I'm worried that my grass is going to die, my roses are going to die, and I'll be starting all over at some point, and it's very costly. Marion Gomez says her property in Pasadena just recovered after an infestation of gophers. We lost all of our plants. I lost about 15 rose bushes, my lawn, and now I'm just starting to get it back and I have water restrictions. Her water restrictions just got tougher after the Pasadena City Council declared a local water emergency. It's a very serious situation. We want to ensure that we have water supply not only for today, but for our children in the future. The City Council vote called for a level one water supply shortage plan. The mandatory water restrictions include limiting watering to three days a week in the summer and one day a week in the winter. It also requires that leaks be repaired with within 72 hours. We want to ensure we take all the steps that we need for, so for our community to start conserving even more water. Marion Gomez says she's watched her neighbor's yards turn from green to brown. She's hoping to save her yard from a similar fate, but she's worried these new water restrictions won't be enough. Not with weather like this, it's not enough. I, I think it needs to um, be related to what the weather conditions are. And this right now seems to me a very, very, very warm time. Mandatory statewide water restrictions go into effect on August 1st. Fines for violating those water restrictions could be as much as $500 for repeat offenders. In Pasadena, Louisa Hodge, CBS 2 News.